and we're back. I don't know if you guys have realized, but I've been trying to give you longer episodes because a lot of people just, you know, they want to see how I how I finish the game, which I very much appreciate. So, we're trying to make it through episode three. It might be like maybe one or two more parts. We'll see. But, uh, well, what is happening here? Okay. I had like a little That's mouse indicator there. <sighs> there were more of us. Dad, get him. Yeah. Yes. Oh, it's a shame. Lee, Lee, I need you right now. Oh no. Now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. <laughs> With what? Oh. Could you just get that off his face, please? Hmm. He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Okay. I gotta hurry, because if I don't, she is going to get bitten and a lot of bad stuff is gonna happen here. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm power walking as fast as I can here. You need to stop the train. You gotta say goodbye to your boy, man. I'm sorry. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's, son's blood. blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that right now. Go back there and tell my wife everything will be fine. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. Stop. Stop the train. Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen. Or what? I don't know what the hell is wrong with you, but you need to lock it up. Be a man here. Oh, you want a piece of me? Is that it? I just wanna I just talk. I just wanna talk, kid. Relax. Then talk. You think you're the reason, you think Duck, you're the was reason bitten. Duck was bitten? Like you had this coming or something? Stop thinking about yourself, man. You feel guilty. Like you killed any chance of a miracle for Duck when you ran away from Sean Green. There's no room for that shit. This isn't about you. It's about a woman back there who needs her husband and a boy who needs his dad. Come on, man. Come on. Come on, Kenny. Damn it, Kenny. Kenny's a good man, but he, he, okay. Thank you, Kenny. Thank you, Kenny. It had to be Duck, man. It had to be Duck. The boy's been bit. In case you haven't figured that out. Jeez. <sighs> what do you need? What do you need? I... I... Gotcha. It's time to... This is not possible. What are we going to do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... What if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... 
Come on, Cat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. He just drift off to sleep. Right, hun? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. God, you fuck. I, I, I can. I can do this. You can't. I love you, Ken, but this is beyond you. I'll do it. No, it should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. Yeah. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Jeez. Really, you'd be doing this family a great service. As always. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Hmm. I gotta talk to Clem. I gotta talk to Clem just so she understands and she knows what's going on. Crazy opening to the episode here, guys. I, I apologize. This part's heavy. This part's real heavy. Ooh, man. This part's super heavy. What's happening? Duck is dying. Duck is dying. I know. Yeah, I know you know. She's seen so much of it now at this point. I'm putting him out of his misery. I want to be honest with her. Look, Clint. Things are. What the? No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. What happened? What happened? She did she kill herself? <sighs> get, get, gotcha. There's no way. She couldn't. God, man. The writers for this series really knew how to like, really knew how to hit the hearts, man. They really knew how to hit the hearts here, man. I'm telling you. Oh, bro. This is heavy, man. This is heavy. You know, like you, like you get those moments okay. where like, wait a minute, I'm wait for this. I'll do it. Gun, I'll do it. I'll do it. <sighs> Jeez. You get those moments where it's like. Dang, man. You get those moments where it's like... <sighs> it's heavy. I'm not crying, but just know that like I had a couple thug tears that were hanging on by a limb. I'm not gonna lie, like they were they were hanging on. Ah, oh, that's heavy, man. That's super heavy, man. 
Duck was annoying as hell, but he didn't have to go out like that. He did not deserve to go out like that. I thought at first it was going to be the mom that got bit, but it was Duck. Why would he say that? Hey, how you doing? Yeah, why would you say that? What reasons you had for doing it? No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Go, she is. They, oh wait, there was a family photo. Oh no, that was the driver though. I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? Find a boat. We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were... You gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. <sighs> She's a little girl, man. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's going to act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Mm. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. <sighs> I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. I know that he's right. People have died already. I know that he's right. I know. Seen another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. Another oh, little girl died. And a gun. It's good advice. It's something. <sighs> you got any family? You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. So he was homeless beforehand. So you're homeless now. You're homeless then. Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and they just don't work out. Fair enough. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. No. <laughs> Yo, he was quick with that. Where are you Where headed? Are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean, when we get to Savannah. You got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. Fair enough. I want to tell him I shot the kid. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Yeah. Be safe up here. You bet. He uh, something's up with Chuck. There's something up with Chuck. I don't. I don't know what it is, but there's something up with Chuck. He's lost both people now. If I get by you for a second, Kitty. Can you just leave me alone? I want to talk to him. Hey. Hey. It'll be good to get to the water. Still want to get that boat? Still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Yeah. It's the best plan. Okay. Hey. Talk to him one more time. Are there any Are there maps, any in maps here? up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. 
He's not gonna let me grab that map, man. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure the cat would be uh, okay with you, so forget it. All right, I'm trying to get this map, but he's not gonna let me get it. That's fine. It's okay. I'll get it when I get it. Let's go check in with the others. Ben is not Ben is not doing okay. Hey. How right, many of us left? left? Yeah, you, me, and Kenny, Clementine, the homeless dude. If he sticks around. Hell, <laughs> we're all homeless. We're all homeless. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah, I guess not. Yeah. I don't want to say Carly didn't have to die. I thought that's gonna that's gonna rub him the wrong way. Good old Clem. Man, there's really not many of us left here. I hope they're not on this train much longer. I'm gonna take this bottle of whiskey. It's a fifth of whiskey. There's some scissors in Chuck's bag. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh, he explained himself and made some good points. Look, I'm not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. She's she's the best, I'm telling you. Okay. What should we do? Well, I'm gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. Hmm. What do you think about Chuck? What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. Yeah. What a crappy what a day. Crappy day. The crappiest. <laughs> ago, I don't know what you'd be seeing. I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I probably would have run out of food. You damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. Aww. Okay, you need to learn to protect yourself, though. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. Hey, <laughs> you look right down the top through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? Aim for the head. These are just bottles, but you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. It might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah. I'm ready. Okay. Come on, Clem. Good. Come on, Clem. Your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. She missed. It's okay. okay. My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah. <sighs> yeah, unfortunately. Come on, Clem. Keep it steady. Steady now. Almost got it. Keep it steady. Steady now. Almost got it. Cause she shot too high. And a little to the left. Wait, no, she used to aim a little bit to the right. To the right. A little bit lower. Lower. Okay. Okay. Aim a little bit 
bit more to the left. Keep it steady. Close. Now keep it steady. There we go. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. I didn't know that we were doing it based on where the last bullet landed. Sorry about that, guys. All right, here we go. Okay, she's got to go a little bit more to the left again. A little bit more to the left. You got to go higher. Okay, a little higher. Good shot, there Clem. Go. Nice. She's got it. She's got it. Here we go. Come on, Clementa. Ooh, first shot. She's yeah, the best. You did. Good job. I just pretended they were walker heads. Like Good job. Like They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, <laughs> I feel good. I'm so glad. Scary, huh? Nuh -uh. I'm glad. I'm glad that worked out. <sighs> they look clean enough. He's lived here a while. I want to talk to her before I just cut her hair. And my ears have noise in them, like. <laughs> okay. You're probably not gonna like this. Oh no! What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. <laughs> Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. Very true. Okay. Let's cut it. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mow. It's a good thing. Let's do it now. That's fine. I feel like this is a consequence that won't come back to bite us, right? Do you know how to do this? Nope. Nope. No idea. Nope. No idea. I'm not much of a stylist, you know. I'm going to look like a boy. Yep. Yeah. But think how much safer you'll be. I'd rather be dead. Shush now. <laughs> So <laughs> Clementine's a trip. Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. I'll tell you that. No, it's yeah. different. It's different. Do it now to protect yourself and to protect me. I was sent to jail. Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay, I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Oh, she's got hair yeah, thingies. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There, all set. She does not like it. Look dumb. <laughs> no, you look cute and a lot harder to grab. Good job, Clem. She does not like this haircut at all, bro. She does not like this haircut at all, man. She's not feeling that. She's really not feeling that. Can I talk to her one more time? Sorry about your hair. I think it looks cute, though. My mom isn't going to like it. All right, let's look around for a few things. For a few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe there. God, me too. I really need to get this map. Okay, let's go. 
Why does it let me look at it instead of just going? What up, Ben? I don't really feel like I want to talk to you right now, to be honest. You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Kenny, I need to talk to you, bro, because you really need to, like... Ah, there's no other options here. I'll uh, talk to you later, Kenny. There's no other options here. I can't freaking get the bin thing. I can see there's a map in there. I don't want to give him any booze, to be honest with you. I really don't. Um, it's full of maps and documents. Get out of here. He's really not letting me do this. Wait, what a second. I was lucky enough to get it working once. All right, nothing I can do there then. Well, the girl can shoot. It doesn't have to be pretty. Probably will be before too long. Do I have to give him the booze? Is that how I advance the story here? I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? No. No, I'm fine. Suit yourself. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. That's how I get it. Gotta tell Kenny. Chuck's asking if you want to share a drink here. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. Yee yee! Yeah. All right, let me go. Uh, let me go see if. Thanks. Ah. Dang it. Hey Ben. Hey. See. Ah, oh, I think I messed up, guys. Yeah. I think I messed up just now. I'm pretty sure I did, because now Kenny's back all of a sudden. Maybe I can convince him to get another drink. And that that'll give me. Have another with Chuck. You'll keep an eye out up here. Sure. Okay. 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 They gave me another option there. I kind I kind of figured that was gonna be a thing. Now we can grab this. Beautiful. Oh. All right. He'll come back in now. And sit down. Thanks. While I go um, share the map with Clementine. Clemmy, Clemmy, Clemmy. Maybe I should share with Ben too. Do I have the option? No, nah, Ben's just going through it right now, man. Maybe I should talk to him and say Carly didn't have to die. Hey. Carly didn't have to die. Have to die you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. See ya. That's a dumb conversation, right? Ben is not gonna like me by the end of this game. It was me. I, was I knew it. The I freaking knew what? it. It's all my fault. Why would you do what that? For? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. You still want to talk to me? Yeah. Yeah, I do. I'm real sorry. Let's drop it for now, okay? What are you, what doing, are you out doing out here? Out here? I, uh, couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was thinking about talking to Kenny. I guess not. That's a bad idea. I'm dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why. 
right? I guess. You better. See you. Yeah. Jeez, man. All right, let's show Clem the map here. Hey, Clem. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. I knew it was Ben. And what we're going to do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. We should go our own way when we get there. The crew is falling apart. You and I are stronger alone. What about the boat? What about Ben? You'll be fine. Okay. Can we at least look for my parents when we get there before we go? Yeah, why not? Okay, we'll look for them. But then we're moving on. Really? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. And unless Savannah is somehow walker free, we know we want to stay out of town. I feel like her parents are long gone, but you don't like we'll see what happens. I don't like the woods. Well, what I think we should do after we look for your mom and dad is head north, keeping water, the, the ocean on our right side. So we can't get surprised by walkers. Exactly. I like the beach. Good. <laughs> Good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. A lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the... M... M... something... Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. Yeah. So, go ahead. Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far. Oh shit! Hold on, everybody! Uh oh. That's not good. And you know what that means? I was actually going to finish out episode three, guys, but um, I have a meeting to hop into, so I'm at the end it here. My name is Kovu. I had to play games. Until then, goodbye. Yeah.